dressing up as Rudolph this year, Cheeky? No, I fell face first into a bowl of cherries. You mean my cherries? I needed those, Cheeky. I know we need to move as quick as we can, but try to be careful, guys. How's the snow going, Susie? OMG, it's a winter wonderland in here. This snow is, like, super swirly, though. That's whipped cream, Susie. So that means I've served my pie with a side of canned snow. How classy. We need help, Apple. We've got so much food to prepare before Christmas Day, not to mention everything else that needs to be done. Hey, gang, what's all the fuss? Hey, Fleur, it's the Christmas rush. Guys, I think I let this sit too long and now it's turned to mush. Sorry, Fleur, we're a little stressed. I'll say you've made a mess. From the stuffing to the pudding, the list just never ends. There is no need to stress when you've tried to do your best. All you need is good old-fashioned help from your friends. Real cook a Christmas feast filled with all sorts of treats. A really yum selection of savories. And sweets. What's that? It's really tasty. It's custard baked in pastry. Mm, you guys have got to taste this gravy. Sarah Tlithica. Well, we help you hang the ribbon. I don't know what I'm doing! Just follow what is written. I'll take care of the chopping. While we hang up all the stacking. Just be careful in the kitchen, because the sink is out of clogging. Once we finish baking. We'll help with decorating. I spilled sauce on me. Don't forget to wear your apron. We'll be done in time for dancer. Dasher, fix, and prancer. Uh, who, like, ate the food we left for Santa? Sorry, I feel awful. As long as you're remorseful. All this food makes me hungry. <gasps> nope, nope, that's a bauble. We finished all the cooking. From the stuffing to the pudding. Now it's time to hang the star. Just, Just be, be careful, careful of your footing. footing. We've done our shopping spree. Wrap the gifts under the tree. Now we can finally relax. But you forgot about me. like all of you. Hey, what's that supposed to mean? Oh, nothing. Eight hours. <sighs> I'm like already kind of tired just thinking about that. Don't yawn, because if you yawn, I'll yawn. Uh, uh, oh. Stay strong, Cheeky. You're about to set off a chain reaction of yawning. The fate of this evening lies in your mouth. for the party tonight. I've written up a list of tasks for everyone to complete. What are you organizing, Apple? That! Now we can have a big New Year's Eve countdown. Who wants to see a 30-foot minute hand? Oh, yes, that's awesome. awesome. Oh, that is absolutely. so cool. That'd be so cool. So, like, does time go slower because the clock is so bad? Still the same speed, Susie. Since you ruined Christmas for me, I'm gonna ruin New Year's for you. Uh. <laughs> a great <sighs> party, Apple. Hang in there, Susie. Not too long to go now. Ah! Happy New Year! Why are you all screaming? That's what you asked for, silly. I have to say, Apple, I'm not a fan of all this screaming. Makes me feel like a common garden weed. Spaghetti in the house! Why did you do that? Well, don't get lippy with lippy. Do you know how hard it was to find a spaghetti cannon? It's not exactly a household item, Apple. What are you all looking at? 
Why, why, why would you do this? That's what you asked for. Earthworks. Fireworks. I asked for streamers, a confetti cannon, and fireworks. Let me see that list. Hey, somebody changed this. We're sorry, Apple. At least we still have the countdown clock. Hey, guys, it's nearly time. Ten, nine, eight, seven. What's that noise? I knew we shouldn't have stayed up this late. Where did the clock go? Uh, I don't know. Hey, you think it's been longer than ten seconds? Probably. Well, Happy New Year, I guess. Hey, Apple, we're really sorry about your clock. I didn't even realize what was happening. I should be more attentive. You know what? That'll be my New Year's resolution. That and reading an entire book. I'm going to clean out my closet. I'm going to get fit. I might take a nap and figure my resolution out later. Oh, wait. I'm, like, totally going to stop napping. Uh, I feel like I've heard all of this already. Okay, time to clean out my closet. Although I am hungry. Yeah, I could go with sandwich. After lunch, I might go shopping. We've never finished any of our resolutions. You know, we didn't technically see the clock strike 12, so it's not the new year yet. I say we make a pact to finish our resolutions before the clock is found. That may not take long, Cheeky. Mayor Cookie has the best Shopkins on the job. Chicken chip, reporting for, for duty. Ugh, oh, not these two little biscuits again. <laughs> you might have more time than I thought, Cheeky. Come on, Chip. We've got work to do. Shh. Okay. Chapter one. Hey, Cheeky, can you help me train? I'm trying to finish my resolution, Toasty. But I need you to help me finish my resolution. Okay, let's place anything that's old in the to-go pile on my bed. I can't be in here, Olipi. Your bed is, like, really making me want to take a nap. Well, don't fall asleep, because I need you to help me finish my resolution. We, we need your help! Keep up the pace, Toasty, and you'll be fit in no time. You get to read, Susie isn't near a bed, Toasty gets to work out, and my closet gets cleaned. Everybody wins. Did you hear that? It can only mean one thing. A fire! The clock! Oh yeah, I mean the clock. I guess I can always start my New Year's resolution tomorrow. Uh, okay, I'm up, I'm up. Shopkins, Shopkins. Shopkins. Uh, hi. What are you doing? Uh, what are we doing? What are you doing? Well, it's my birthday coming up, so I'm shopping for a new purse. I think it came from this direction. Mm. Mm. Now my hand smells like cherry cupcakes. You know, a clock that size would be better suited in a central location. Would you like some help repositioning it? We're hiding it. <laughs> Duh. Oh, from who? My friends. I mean... Uh, a group of acquaintances. Acquaintances who couldn't even remember to get me a Christmas gift. You better not tell. Act natural. I won't. Because I'm going to give you the chance to make things right. Hey, you, Cupcake, you look guilty of, of, of something. Hey, stop accusing my friends of stealing. Your friends? Of course, Yolanda. 
Speaking of that, why aren't you wearing the bracelet we got you for Christmas? What do you mean? Lippy, did you put Yolanda's bracelet in her stocking? Uh, sorry, Toasty and I were still braiding it on Christmas morning. It's a friendship bracelet. Oh. <laughs> Belated Christmas! We're gonna keep looking for our clock. Let me know if you see anything. Will do. <sighs> Morning, everyone. Ugh, what time is it? <sighs> 7.30. Oh! <gasps> What's it counting down to? It's too early for the next New Year's. I'm sorry your New Year's was ruined in the worst way. So instead, let's count down Jesse Cake's birthday. What a great oh, idea. Oh, so so fast. Fast. This is such a lovely gesture. Oh, wait. There's another card inside. Every birthday party needs a cake and a Kate. Somebody wants you to have a special birthday. Any idea who it is? I have a few ideas. Check you later. Just love mornings in Shopville. The sun is shining, the birds are chirping. Buncho is doing his morning fitness routine. I'm working on my car. Yep, another beautiful day in. Whoa! Jesse Cake, are you okay? <gasps> oh, hey guys, what's up? Jesse Cake! <gasps> oh, hey guys, what's up? You didn't get much sleep last night, did you? I was up all night watching highlights from last year's Tea Jubilee. Woohoo! Yeah, yeah, come on, let's drink some tea! Brew, brew, brew! They have competitive tea drinking? I watch it every year. Oh, but I want to see it in person so bad. Why don't you? The Tea Jubilee is always held somewhere in Europe, and that's so far. Guys? Shopkins huddle. This tea thing means so much to Jesse Cake. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? I doubt it. Say what you're thinking. We have to figure out a way to get them to do the next one here in Shopville. Yeah, I wasn't thinking that. I was thinking about candy. But I like that idea. Don't you worry, Jesse Cake. You may not be able to make it to Europe, but we are going to figure out a way to bring Europe to you! If this video doesn't convince them to have that big tea party here in Shopville, nothing will! Hello, and welcome to Shopville, a wonderful place to visit and hopefully the home of this year's Tea Jubilee! We have so much to show you. Tell them, Cookie. We do. Shopville is the perfect place for the Tea Jubilee. We've got it all! A grocery store! Plenty of parking! And just look how much everybody here loves tea! I love tea! <laughs> oh. And scent! Now we just wait for them to call and tell us they're moving the big tea party to Shopville! Hello? Yes? Really? No way! Okay, bye! <gasps> they're going to have the tea jubilee in Shopville? No. Wrong number. Hello? <gasps> They're going to have the tea jubilee in Shopville! I can't wait to see the look on Jessie Cake's face when we tell her! You mean, I'm finally going to get to see the tea jubilee in person? That's... that's... <sighs> Tell her again when she wakes up. Shopkins! 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 Oh, 
Hey, Shoppies and Shopkins. Thanks to you, Europe's grandest, most exciting competitive tea party is coming to Shopville. And that means we'll be hosting the world's foremost experts on all things tea. So we have to put our best foot forward and show them that Shopville knows how to tea party. Who can tell me the proper way to stir a cup of tea? Who can tell me the difference between an Earl Grey and a Darjeeling Black? Uh, uh, um, what's tea? We have work to do. Good. Good, Cheeky. Watch that spoon clinking on the cup when you stir. Bubblicia. Elbows off the table. Donatina. Perfect pinky positioning, Peppermint. Oh, I've never been so proud. I think our work here is done. Wait, where's Buncho? <laughs> Did I do it wrong? <sighs> it's a good thing I like a challenge. Okay, just take it nice and easy. No. No. Definitely no. It's no use. I give up. Look, Buncho! He's doing it! Perfection. <laughs> ah, close enough. Everybody, I think Shopville is just about ready for inspection. Once the Tea Jubilee official gives Shopville a final approval, we'll be all set to host the big tea competition. Hmm. What? Huh? Why are you humming? Everything looks great. I just really want to make a good first impression. Just wondering if there's a way to make Shopville feel a little more, I don't know, European. Oh, I know. We could start talking with European accents. That's not an accent that exists anywhere. Don't worry about it. Shopville looks fantastic. It was just a thought. You know what? If Jessie Cake wants European, I say we give her European. I say that's a great idea. Let's do it. Yeah, I'll stop doing that. Good morning. You must be the Tea Jubilee official here for the inspection. Indeed. We are so excited to be hosting this year's Tea Jubilee. I hope you find everything is to your liking. I say, what is that? Um, I don't know what that is. Ah, I see a very European clock tower says it's 10 o'clock. That's true. European Canal! I, I... I don't know what to say. I... Oh, what now? Oh. And now, the Shopville running off the bones! Miss Cone, I am so sorry. Never in my life have I experienced anything of this kind. This is all just a big misunderstanding. I... I love it. You what now? She what now? Every year it's the same old tea party. Sit quietly, 
Sip tea, the notable absence of gondolas careening down the street. Uh-huh. The excitement of Shopville is exactly what the Tea Jubilee needs this year. A little unexpected fun. Yeah, didn't see that coming. Congratulations, Jassy Cake. You may consider Shopville approved. Let the Tea Jubilee begin. Oh, here comes that bull again. Watch me run. <laughs> Jubilee is finally happening, and right here in Shopville. Oh, Cookie, look! That's Queen Cake, the world famous tea expert. She seems nice. Hey, Apple, what's that? That's the VIP section for very important people. I'm very important, right? Excuse me. I believe that tea was intended for me. Whoops. 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 Bubblesha didn't mean anything by it, Ms. Queen Cake. And who are you? Jessie Cake, ma'am. I'm the Tea Jubilee's biggest fan. Fancy yourself a tea expert, do you? I... Yeah, she does. Bubblesha, I can... You think you can tea better than me? Yeah, she does. No, I... All right, then. You like tea? Let's have... Tea. Oh. It's a tea party throwdown! You know the rules. Good manners takes all. Go, Jessie Cake! <gasps> I guess Queen Cake wins. No, you had me beat. You threw the match on purpose. Why? Because you're Queen Cake, a tea hero. I could never beat you. This compassion and sportsmanship is exactly what the Tea Jubilee is all about. Jessie Cake, you're the real winner here. Wow, I can't believe you threw that tea match on purpose. Uh, yeah. Jessie Cake? <laughs> I'll never tell. After all, you heard what she said. I won the Tea Jubilee! <laughs> <laughs>